Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. Before we begin, I put some more stuff on Let Go, and I'm selling it. If anybody is interested in buying the stuff I'm selling, any of the stuff I'm selling, please let me know. On my let go page or even here on my YouTube channel in the descriptions down below okay here's what just thought I bring that up before I begin okay here's what I want to talk about Pokemon Ash should catch in the future Here's what Pokemon Ash should catch in the future. I have a list of a few Pokemon. Fero. And I mean that Fero that that he met years ago as a Spearow. I know he caught one in the manga, but he should catch one, catch that same one that he met years ago. They should bring this one back and then have Ash catch it. And here's Oddish. Ash should catch this Oddish like he did in the manga. Just leave it as an oddish. And here's here's an, another one. Polywag. He should catch a male polywag like his male counterpart Red did. And then evolve it into a slow... I mean, into a... Into a polywhirl. And then get a water stone and evolve it into Polyrath. Like his manga counterpart Red did. Okay, here's the next one. Slowpoke. Ash should catch Slowpoke. And instead of trading it to Gary for something or another Pokemon, he should keep it. And evolve it into slow bro. That's what Ash should do. And 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 of course Ash should catch Eevee like his manga counterpart Red did and evolve it. with happiness in the daytime into Espeon. And Ash should catch Riolu and evolve it into Lucario. And I've got one more. One other Pokemon Ash should catch is Mew. Ash should catch Mew in the future and maybe even get the Mew Z Crystal. That way he can use as he could use its Z move. Anyway, those are the Pokemon I think Ash should catch. I think it's a great idea. Let me know what you guys think about these ideas that I said in the comments down below. And please like, subscribe, and share my videos. 
and I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.